During the pregame of today's Game 2 Stanley Cup Final matchup, the TNT crew had Connor Bedard join them as a guest. This is hockey's biggest stage, and the NHL bringing Bedard along with Adam Fantilli, Will Smith, and Leo Carlson to the game continues the tradition that the NHL started 30 years ago, bringing the soon-to-be-drafted prospects to the Stanley Cup Final. In this case, having Bedard, one of the hottest prospects in years, actually joining the panel and the discussion like this, again, during the cup final is a great way to get millions of eyeballs on one of the players who is likely to play a big role in the future of this league for many years to come. What's more, it was nice actually seeing Bedard's personality shine a bit. I heard there's a story that Gretz had texted you or called you before. Did you really believe it was 99 of called and text you? <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, I was, I answered, I remember I was, I was 15, so, or 14 actually, so I couldn't really speak at all. And, uh, you know, I didn't know if it was a prank call or what, but um, no, that was crazy. It was, it was real, eh? Yeah. 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 No, you know what that but one of my favorite parts of this segment came when he threw some shade at Paul Bissonnette. Let me just play it for you. Are, are you getting used to this being the new normal for you? Uh, you know, I'll say a couple pretty good players on this panel, and, and Biz is here, too. So. <laughs> oh, oh, some more clicks. Oh, okay, some more clicks. Okay, okay. Somebody throwing shots at me, all right? And another dig at Biz, who's become a bit of a punching bag as of late, but he's playing his role well, and I've really enjoyed watching him. Another fun TNT segment here, and I've said it a lot now, but I really think TNT has done a great job covering the league this year. But yeah, that's just a quick one here today I wanted to highlight. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it very much, and I will see you in the next one.